Resurrection power is what gives proof that Jesus rose from the dead and he's alive forevermore. I'm um, Abu Bakari Alusuba Yakubu. Anytime I'm in Tamale, this is where I fellowship. I enjoy the church service particularly today because Pastor preached on hindrances to the resurrection power. Hindrance to experiencing the resurrection power is ungodly living. Ungodly living. My take home scripture is Proverbs chapter 15, verse 1, which says that a soft word turneth away wrath, and a good word presents solution to any situation. I enjoyed the sermon so much because it fosters unity in the church. I enjoy the sermon because it brings meaning to the power of the resurrection. Let all bitterness and wrath and anger and clamor and evil speaking be put away from you with all malice. He said, let all bitterness be put away from you. All bitterness should be put away from you. More excited was the fact that we had to worship and dance at the end of the day. Church was awesome, church was great, and church was more. My name is Joseph, and today's word touched me in particular. In fact, especially when he talked about bitterness and letting go, and then forgiving people who have hurt you. You cannot be a child of God and allow the sun to set on an offense somebody has caused you and you are comfortably walking about. You are risking your destiny to hell. My name is Nawai Naomi. I'm a member of this church and today's service was impactful. It was awesome. Daddy spoke a lot about letting go of envy, jealousy, he even spoke about um, forgiveness and it has been very impactful to me and I'm so grateful to be part of this church. Today being the resurrection day, I had the privilege to be in the service and it was an awesome moment for me, particularly, especially during the worship session. I had the opportunity to join with God's people to worship God even as he has resurrected yes I've been in this church for like five years and over the years the preachings of Papa has modeled my life and today's preaching was actually one of the topics that influences life a lot I happened to get the opportunity to learn that anger is something that if you do not deal with it becomes toxic to your body so we should learn to control our temper and also we should learn to forgive for our own benefit Listen. Anger is toxic for your soul. When you are angry, you are the one that suffers. Not the person you are angry about. Or angry of. Praise the Lord. It has been a nice experience to be at church, especially on a resurrection Sunday like this. Today we were taught about the hindrances of the resurrection power. And we are made to know that we have to live a godly life. The more we live a godly life, that is the more God power can be shown in our life. It has been a blessing to be at service today and I encourage you to also be at service any Sunday. Join us and be blessed. Approach of the portions and everybody has been excellent. And uh, you have very quality sound, which is one of the things that really impressed me. And the composure of your power, the way they are able to blend the songs and move the atmosphere and above all the man of God has been impactful today especially talking about forgiveness I really enjoyed everything about the service most especially the praises and which I haven't danced like this for a long time a message from Papa was also really great today's service was very powerful and I just enjoyed the dancing aspect I could just imagine the youth being like they move from the top to the front and they just enjoy themselves through dancing. I really enjoyed it. I love planting youth Philadelphia pastor. I love Philadelphia pastures. I love Philadelphia. And church was more. Mm -hmm.